Good evening. We are hearing from more of the students who showed their support for Julius Jones by walking out of class. We're hearing from teachers as well. News 9's Angelicia Bruton explains their activism and the role their teachers played. Hundreds of students across the state decided to take a stance and rally in support of Julius Jones. Teachers and officials say they respect their students' decision to stand up for what they believe in. Students flooding football fields and locking arms in solidarity. They also traveled to McAllister, assembling outside of the state penitentiary. I think it makes us feel powerful, like as if, as, like, we, like we inspired other people. I think, it, uh, I think it brought a lot of us together and it showed a lot of students what community was. I think it inspired other students to kind of continue getting out there, uh, show them that they have a voice. Justice! When do we want it? Now! John Marshall, the school that he went to, those students go to school in my district now. And so to see the young people walk out, that gives me hope. Those are the kinds of things that say we have a future of people that will stand for change. Oklahoma City Public Schools issued a statement saying children are the future. And over the past few days, we got a glimpse of that future as we watch students from across the metro use their voices in peaceful protest for an issue they were passionate about. Una Anderson is a visual arts teacher at Douglas High School. Our young Trojans are very well informed. They're very civilly engaged and they, they care a great deal. Anderson helped keep students safe as they gathered outside the school holding posters. She says seeing young people making their voices heard is heartwarming. Civil engagement is profoundly important. I would say it's vital to anything good happening uh, in the country in the future. So um, just that alone was so beautiful and, and so great to see. Angelicia Bruton, Oklahoma Zone, News 9.